September is Peripheral Arterial Disease Awareness Month, and this next Ask the Medical Expert has been sponsored by the Midwest Institute for Non-Surgical Therapy, also known as MINT. Joining me is Dr. Goke Akinwande. Doc, thanks for being here with us today. Thanks for inviting me again. Of course, and I mean, let's dive in. What is Peripheral Arterial Disease? So obviously we talked about this about a year ago, and I'm glad we're able to talk about this because this is very important for people to understand. I mean. In St. Louis, the rates of diabetes keeps going up and up and up, and it goes hand in hand with the rates of uh, obesity as it goes up. That causes um, narrowing to the arteries in the legs, and what you essentially have is basically arteries that used to look like that when you were born, and now your arteries are now clogged wow. up. And when it's clogged up, your legs don't have enough uh, fuel, don't, don't have enough oxygen, and then the skin starts to break down, it causes sores and then this gets infected. And when it gets infected, if you go to the wrong person, you, can, you may get an amputation. So this is actually important to be able to educate people that amputations could be prevented and they could be treated. Um, you don't have to have an amputation for these things. And you mentioned diabetes. What role does diabetes play in PAD? So diabetes is a chronic disease. Um, it, obviously, we know it has high blood sugar. Um, it, but what happens is diabetes, it's very, very hard on the arteries in your leg, especially the tiny vessels. As the blood vessels go, get smaller and smaller down the leg, it, it starts to um, narrow those arteries. And then uh, when your, your arteries are narrowed, you start to get pain. And some people don't have pain, but it causes um, a deficiency in the amount of blood flow that goes down to the foot. And that's, that's why people get sores, and that's why you notice a lot of people with diabetes can get, get amputations. And I mean, your whole name is non-surgical therapy. Yep. What are some of the treatments that are available for so, PAD? So first of all, you want to be able to diagnose it. Um, I actually have a little toy here. Uh, so early diagnosis is key. We want to prevent it, right? So, so typically, if you uh, allow me, that's a little device that goes down to the thumb, that, go, that goes in the thumb, I mean the thumb or the finger, and then down to your foot, and it measures the difference in blood flow between them. It measures the difference in blood flow between them. It takes about five minutes, and we can tell if you have peripheral arterial disease. It's that if, easy. If you have yeah, that easy, and if you have peripheral arterial disease, we can prevent it. There are ways to prevent it. But if you do have peripheral arterial disease, there are minimally invasive ways you can treat it without having surgery, major surgery. I love that. And this is actually a way that you screen to see if PAD is in someone's body. And you're actually Absolutely. giving away, free, you're doing free screenings for the month of September. I am doing free screenings. Um, there will be free screenings um, um, throughout the month of September. And I want the audience to know that a lot of times they don't come in for treatment uh, or, or early diagnosis because they feel like insurance doesn't cover treatments for it. So most. Almost all the treatments for peripheral arterial disease are covered by insurance, and so uh, we do do free screenings, but if you do have to get escalated to more care, um, it is covered by insurance. Well, that is great information. That's what this is all about, just raising awareness. In St. Louis, if you're at home watching and you're wondering, hmm, I might have PAD, look no further than Dr. Akinwande. He will absolutely take care of you. Three different locations across our greater St. Louis area. It's the Midwest Institute for Non-Surgical Therapy. You can visit them online at mintstl.com. And you can also show them some love on Instagram at mintvascular. Or again, just visit their websites right there on your screen. Doc, thanks so much for being here with us. Thank we you. Appreciate absolutely. It. Pleasure. Of course, St. Louis, don't go anywhere. We'll be right back in just a couple of minutes.